Good morning. It is Monday. Omar, what are you doing? Chilling. Uh, this futon is temporary. We have ordered a couch. It should be here very soon. One time I bought a $7,000 couch. One of the biggest mistakes I've ever made. This couch is like 800 bucks. Put up a shelf. More trinkets. We got shit everywhere. Trinkets, 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 trinkets. Sunday, yesterday. Spent all day drawing. Literally. Sat here, drew all day long, ate some Chinese food. Wasn't that great. I think that I'm over Chinese, American Chinese food. I don't think I like it anymore, but I drew a lot of stuff. I'm really just sitting down and drawing. Not necessarily for anything, just putting pencil to paper and energy in the air. Uh, I'm probably gonna do the same thing today. It's Monday. I really wanted to go on a bike ride this morning, but it was so hot. I woke up this morning, it was 93, 5.30. It's just too much, bro. I mean, I'm only been going on a 45-minute bike ride. God. Damn, so I didn't go. It's kind of bumming me out a little bit. Probably go tomorrow no matter what the temperature is. But yeah, it's a hot week for sure, and a hot one. Air conditioning, it's working, working somewhat. I think we're still waiting on a new one. See what happens. That's the update from this morning. Abner went to go get a haircut, so he's not here. So he'll be back looking crazy. It's hours later. I've been sitting at this desk just drawing and drawing and drawing more stuff. You know, I got ideas. The hard part, coming up with the next drop, basically. But the uh, hard part is, you know, drawing is free, freedom, you know? Like you can draw freely and do whatever you want. And I love it. That's why I like drawing. And that's how I started out was like, oh, I'm just gonna draw whatever I want. Then I'm like, okay, now I don't know what I wanna draw. And then I get stuck. Stuff I really like, you know, as a brand, I have to look at it like, will this, will this sell? You know what I mean? Is this something that people are gonna like? So then it becomes just a, a mind war. And uh, then you start getting all kinds of fucking weird anxieties and second guessing yourself, shit like that. That's when I go take a dab personally or <laughs> go play with the dog, by the way. Both dogs are gone right now. Omar's getting his nails trimmed because we can't find our nail trimmers. Uh, as many of you pointed out, he probably needs his nail trimmed for the floors, which yes, agreed. Somehow we lost the nail trimmers, clippers, whatever you want to call them. I also started working on the Koala collab today, but that's top secret for now, I guess. Abner, you don't have any hair. Abner, you don't have any hair. Are you so happy about it? Are you so happy? You feel good? Happy. I think it feels great. I think it is too. Good morning. It is, uh, it's, uh, 520. We're gonna try and beat the sun. It's coming out a little bit. We ain't ride our bike in like three days. That's gotta end today. So we're out here at 5.30 a.m. Getting to it, dog. Getting to it. So Alex just left with the dogs to go to PetSmart. I, I am getting ready to leave, trying to get prepared for a new drop. That's basically what my week is. This a lot of drawing and just kind of waiting to see what to do as far as the tattoo situation goes. So we're gonna wait, we're waiting, just waiting to see what happens. That's pretty much it. So today, because we're waiting, we already went on a bike ride and it's already getting hot as fuck. We're gonna go pick up Dirty Urn. Venturing out. Now, if you don't know, Dirty Urn is very, very afraid of contracting COVID-19. Very. Now, a lot of people are, so we're not gonna make fun of him. But, but today he's decided he will venture to the fashion show mall and go say what's up to JC. That's what we're gonna go do. I'm gonna go pick him up right now. Apparently the snitch has returned. That's the text I got. Dog, back to snitching. You got your mask? Yeah, oh yeah, in my okay. pocket. I stay with the mask. Oh, okay. so back first off, bitch. 
No. In what? this bitch for like the first time since we've moved. That's true. What are you talking about? Maybe the first time you've been in my car since a COVID outbreak, even. Crash your window. That's right. actually, that's the truth there. <laughs> yeah. You got it's the balls COVID. today. I don't. I'm terrified, honestly. I'm not <laughs> like, I'm just terrified. There's but not that many people. I know. Though. Well, that's what I'm thinking in my head. I'm fine. I just, I need to think myself through this, but uh, I'm good. I got it. Sounds stuffed up, man. I am, but that's just like allergies, not oh. not COVID. Oh. You have a COVID test? <laughs> no, but Do you have an allergy test? Well um so this morning, you know, I, I'm trying so hard, I don't want to snitch on anybody. There's some people you know, it's different than the courtyard at home where all the dogs are just in one area. There's some people that walk their dogs around off leash. Fine, great with me, no problem. None of this stuff bothers me anymore. I have my own section, it's fine. This morning, there's this one gray cat that sits out on the balcony all the time. Same thing, I walk by the balcony, it doesn't bother the dogs, they're not bothered by it. I don't give a fuck that these people keep their cat on the balcony. Today, Maya is sniffing a bush near the back side of these people's wall. This cat comes flying out, dude, like war. Like, <laughs> like claws flying, trying to rip Maya's face off. I'm running backwards with Maya like 20 feet. The cat is chasing us down the sidewalk, just like <sighs> swinging, losing it. I literally had to, and let me make clear, I didn't kick the cat, but I lifted the cat with my fucking foot and like <laughs> tossed it and kept, and kept running and it's still <sighs> coming at us like fucking what insanity. Fuck? Maya's like terrified. I'm like, Jesus Christ. Maya's not going off? Well, at the beginning she was, okay. but then once I start pulling her away and we get away, she's just like in this mode of like, what the fuck? Well, that's, you know, and that's what I said to the people in the office. I was like, yo, if I, wait, let, wait, wait. <laughs> let's get to that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so I call the office. And, Are dogs and animals allowed off leash here? And he's like, no, they're not really. Why? Is there an issue? And I'm well, there's this cat and I see it off leash all the time. Hey, I don't even think it's supposed to be outside. I don't care. Until today. Literally tried to attack my cat. And he's like, all right, all right. Well, we'll talk yeah. to the management and see what happens. Like all nonchalant. And that pissed me off. So I walked yeah. down to the office. I was like, all right, buddy, where's your manager? manager. And, <laughs> well, you want to be a little full circle here. You know, then they're like, well, we've called animal control. I'm like, you don't have to call animal control. Like, I don't want these people's cat taken away. I'm like, Damn, just man. tell the people to keep the cat inside. They go, yeah, no, they probably won't take it away. For the record, I knocked on these people's door because I was going to tell them to their face, like, yo, your cat just tried to attack my dog. My dog will eat your cat. I was trying to leave the office out of it. These are my new neighbors. Yeah, so that's that's that. Wow. Right, yeah. right. That's, uh, it's crazy. It's crazy that you had a cat killed today. Yeah. Well, <laughs> like initial reactions to run. And then when it keeps coming, I'm like, do I have to fuck it? Am I going to have to like you really have to boot this thing? Like, this am I going to? Yeah, like. I'm not gonna have fuck? to lift this thing with my foot. Yeah. Not a kick. <laughs> yeah, not a but kick. I won't kick a motherfucker, but I'll lift it with my foot. <laughs> it was more of a lob. Like a, yeah, like a soft lob. Yeah. Just like a soft suggestion with your foot to get the fuck out of the way. A little more incognito. This is an undercover vlog. How not to get kicked out of malls. Yeah, how not to get kicked out of malls. Don't try to look like Casey Neistat. <laughs> yeah, we're back. We didn't. We didn't do anything. Well, we drank. We, some, uh, we drank a drink. We did drink a drink, but Ugh. we didn't see JC. He was running late. We didn't feel like waiting, so we are. Uh, we're out. A new, a new hut and a new foliage as well. Bowl, lights. He's got his muddy Glow in the dark rocks. Edward really got a Vegas upgrade. Edward's living the Vegas life. It's a roomy. It's like a whole new world for him. Edward, it's his gift for surviving. <laughs> experience Edward's new Las Vegas resort and spa. What you doing dog? Just swimming around? Alright, good night. Oh, it's 5.30 this morning. 5.19. I tried to get out here even earlier. We're going on the exact same loop. Just my morning bike ride at this point. It's 82 degrees, so it's chilly. It's chilly for Vegas right now. I'm gonna stop talking and go, because I'm gonna burn more daylight. I wanna get back so fast. Right, we're back. We're back from the bike ride. It is 6.05. It took 41 minutes, 24 seconds. We went 8.77 miles today. The other day it was 8.88. It's been 8.88 every day. That's a quad lock case. It works pretty well. Quad lock, send me some shit now. Yeah, that guy's over. I got sweat in my eyes. I gotta get inside. Oh my God. But it was nice and cool. Sun's barely out. That's what I'm talking about. All 
turn fucking focus off today like you did yesterday. Oh shit. Um, I made you a sandwich. You ever yeah. hear of Taylor Ham? Taylor Ham and cheese. It's a New Jersey pork roll, but there's a brand called Taylor Ham. A big argument in Jersey is, is it pork roll? Is it Taylor Ham? You ask Jersey people, they'll be in the comments fighting with each other over the name. But either way, it is the best meat on the face of this planet. And right. there it is. You want to test it now or not yet? Well, wait till we get, is it okay to wait? Yeah, it's all right to wait. It'll probably stay pretty warm because yeah. It's fucking hot out here. Outside. So off we go to see JC round two. Yeah, dude, it's fucking banging. Yeah, right. you know, literally the only place I've ever seen this is Jersey. They have Taylor Ham here? Are you fucking kidding? Mm. So I stocked up. They might run out. I don't know. I'm like, are they going to keep ordering this? Is this something special? How many Jersey mobsters out here? That's literally what I thought. I swear to God, dude, that's what I thought. I'm like, there's so many Jersey douchebags out here that are yeah. like, hey, you got Taylor Ham? Check in with JC shortly. Maybe I'll do some sneaker reviews. You don't Maybe know. You should cop samples like your old days, you know. Yeah. Copped sandals the other day for twenty dollars. Brandy got for me. Adidas slide Ad adiage or however the massage ones with the little bumps in them. What the fuck? Why? I Why would you even get those? Isn't that funny? Those shoes aren't even comfortable. I said the same thing. Yeah, I exactly. don't mind them now. Brandy's had them her whole life. Again for me last time. I'm like, I don't want those. Yeah. It feels if like you're, you're walking on phones, fucking. You fucked up. Like what? Like why? Why? Them shits are so uncomfortable. They've been uncomfortable since the day they came out. No one actually likes those. She's full of shit. We definitely went the wrong way. I don't know where the fuck we're at. This is amazing. But lost in the noodle bowl. Yeah, lost in the noodle bowl for sure. God, them shits are fucking so gross. Remember when they came out, they were gross. Yeah, they like massage your feet. They do not massage your feet. <laughs> no, I don't think they Without do. socks, they're torture. Clear, hard rubber, like you can't even budge them. You know, Hitler invented those. That was a torture. <laughs> We're lost. We've we're, been not just, lost. Like, we're not we're lost. We're not lost. We just keep missing, just keep missing, missing, turns. missing turns. No, dude, in your defense, the GPS really doesn't tell where the forks are. This happens to me all the time, but I, I assumed it was just me. You gotta try your sandwich first. We're here, okay. We're here, and you just let out a deep sigh. Yep, the last breath I'll take for a while. Ah, <laughs> oh, you just hold your breath all the time. We're inside. All right, let's try and see what the Hormel's ham tastes like. Taylor ham. Taylor, Taylor ham. ham. I'm mean, pretty good. Yeah, dude, it's good. I don't know why. It's like city ham. Is that what it is? Yeah, you know the difference between city ham and country ham? No. Salt. Yeah, it's, that, it's like a pork roll. I mean, people call it pork roll, but it's Taylor Ham brand. John Taylor. That's his John name. John Taylor, fuck it up, dog. Yeah. yeah. I'm masking up. Let's do it right now. Got the <laughs> kit. I'm going no mask just so he can get a little video, you know? No. A little confrontation on the. Yeah. People probably won't even bother you out here. Hey, man likes to gamble, you know? Yeah. I'm strapped up. My ear's ready. All these people, yeah, this is... Like this. Yeah. Can you walk around yeah, now? six feet. Keep them six hey, feet, hey, folks. Hey. There's a lot of people here. Start Keep that people six feet. Like yeah. Arm is Arms like out, people. folks. Arms out. Keep your distance. Forbidden necessities. You wanted to see Dior's, right? Yeah. Yeah, I'm ready. I got in the raffle, but didn't. You along with... Five million other yeah. people. Yeah. But so we've had four of them already. Oh and shit. We've sold two. There's one. I'll show you your Jordan stuff. Come on. No. <laughs> Look who's here. When I saw him yesterday, he tried to stun me in the hallway. <laughs> so I can two dust bags, oh. one for each shoe. The thumbnail coming up right here, son. Alright, then it came with an extra set of uh screen printed? Oh shoot. Not even stitched. You gotta cut the corner somewhere. <laughs> Shoes are twenty two hundred retail. Yeah. Uh, nice hang skin. tag. Ooh. Nice. Sterling silver. We should do shoe unboxing together more often. I can already tell this could be a thing. Let me feel the weight. Oh come on. That's not too hard. Wow. But I'll say it is. That shit's nice. <laughs> then there's one with laces. Nice. And then uh, paper. 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 And they got your mama's purse. I do like the look, dog. Mama's you know, purse cut us on the thing. Yeah. So you know what I did? Because you know me, I'm Lord of the One Upper. So I was fortunate enough to uh, get a pair of reserve based off my spin at Dior. Oh, nice. Uh, so I picked the low top. I, I have a friend who won a low uh, high top in my size, which I'm picking up tomorrow. I wanted to customize my boot to match mm. the Dior's. It'd probably be easier to get a purse and cut it up, right? Right, but there was no purse that's this actual same oh. print. I found the shirt that's the same print, same 
same material and I, I bought the shirt to cut it up to turn it into a boot. When I wear the low top, because I only have to wear one, I'm going to tie the high tops around my neck. <laughs> I also have a Dior blazer and I bought the Dior Jordan slacks and I'm going to cut them into shorts. I can wear this whole ensemble at once. It'll be good. 2,797 out of 8,500. That's wild. Yeah. So what are your thoughts? Honest thoughts. Do you I don't like them. Don't like them. I like the clear bottoms. But, I mean, I think it's a boring colorway, though. And Dior is not my, I mean, I don't really understand why people like Dior. I love it. Well, Kim Jones went over there and he's really kind of brought, brought awareness in the urban culture to this brand. Mm. I think he did a great job with Stussy, you know, kind of unifying the two and giving Dior a, a more modern look on iconic pieces. Get it, it's not for everybody, but I think from a presentation standpoint, about as good as they possibly could, given the fact that they're trying to protect integrity here. Yeah, right? it fits their moniker. I'm not saying, yeah. but it's just for me, like any of the any of the big brands reaching down now for me is kind of weird. The well, initially Kim Jones was going to do this with Louis Vuitton, but it's not going to get shown. But there's one left out there, and it had a, a Louis Vuitton Damier print, and he's not a fan, right? Mm -hmm. And then there's another shoe that was gifted to him, or was supposed to be gifted to him, which is Louis Vuitton leather. But by then, he was already on the way out. He held on to the collaboration and brought it to Dior. So from what I'm hearing, there's possibly three more colorways coming. I, I, I like it. I like them. Why do you like it? Remember I told you in, in vlogs, too, you, we were talking about big names designers and i said dior was the number but one thing when i was dude. younger it's all owned by bernard oh the, the bernard guy the old guy he's like the sixth richest dude in the world he owns all this yeah. Dior, louis all of them yeah that's lvma owns everything bernard well I, you let an old man dress you know no i, I like it there's nothing wrong I with just it dress we're, like old we're old man. we're getting people dressed up listen yeah. stop <laughs> it's not making sense i don't i only want to dress people cease he doesn't even know how he wants to dress, let alone who he wants to be dressed like. He don't care, he's true to this. Teddy's favorite uh, <laughs> influencer in the world line, Yeezys. Yeah. We have probably a few thousand. My favorite nice. preacher. Your favorite preacher? That's my favorite yeah. preacher. My favorite gospel album artist. Did you see uh, any of that for me? Yeah, this Box DHL. Box DHL. You always want to do an unboxing? Unboxing. Yeah, the hallway unboxing. Oh no, that says John. It's gotta be shoes, right? What did Joni get? Joni, we're unboxing your shoes for you. It's a present for you. We're gonna. Why oh. is this in Joni's name? Oh. Maybe she bought a couple pairs of Drake Jordan. Why would Joni want DMP sixes in a size nine? This has got to be consignment. Mystery package. Hey, if you don't get your payout, it's because you fucking yeah. didn't do it right. It's a good trip in the mall. This is business stuff business handled I, everything i'm about to recap you're gonna see in the vlog in a minute so signing out we'll see you guys later i'm uh i don't know what i'm doing maybe i'm going to my pool covid stew i think it's COVID funny that you sit in a pool yeah That's because fine. the chlorine they they there's oh, the chlorine kills in the sunlight supposedly too. chlorine and sunlight Why are killing don't it don't make everybody go outside yeah dump chlorine on the entire planet and then we'll see what happens it's true everybody open your mouth drink a little chlorine yeah see that i could see trump Suggesting that. Why not? That was working. Yeah. It's so early. What do you want? Huh? It's 4 30 in the morning, Bubba. What do you want? You should go lay down. I know. It's way too early for you. I know. Ugh. Oh, yeah. Here we go, baby. 4 53. This is looking pretty good. <laughs> We're about to leave in about six minutes. Five o'clock in the morning, pre-sun bike ride number two. It must be done. No camera today. Same loop, We're gonna shave off some more minutes. All right, uh, the bike ride has been over for a while, so seven. So I've just been chilling. Recovering from the bike. I'm gonna finish up the drawings. I'm gonna send off the lookbook. The drop comes in today. We're gonna start shipping the drop. We got a lot of things kind of happening. Oh, we got sponsored by Liquid Death. Bottled in majestic mountains, liquid death mountain water will murder your thirst.
See all this liquid death? Almost forgot. See all this? Let's get this DV out of here. They don't sponsor us. Liquid death? Look, I completely chased liquid death down. The drink is gonna be in the vlog podcast. The tweeter, the Instagram, the everything. It's just what I'm gonna be drinking. So come on. Like, hook a brother up, you know? And hook everybody else up too. Let's get this let's get these discounts going, bro. Let's make some moves. Let's let's collab. Let's do a can. Let's do a box. We haven't gotten there yet. Let's do a shirt. We haven't gotten there yet. But we have gotten to the point where I have a discount code. Oh, it's Teddy. And you can get 10% off your order. And every time you order, it shows that you're fucking with me to them. You know, that's a good thing. And y'all went off last night. I tweeted these details and y'all went off. Y'all went off so hard that they emailed me back and said, dude, people are already buying cases. So shout out to you. I saw one guy bought like $300 worth of water. Some of y'all are crazy. I love you for it. But I gotta get out of here. It's an editing day. I'm gonna finish a drawing day and a figure out the weekend day. Cause I don't really know what's gonna happen yet. Really anything. So I have a little bit of waiting to do. So I may go out of town and ride my bike. Not really sure where, just to get out of the heat. Podcast soon. Twitch real soon. I feel real bad. Twitch today. All right, peace.